Hello, my name is Paul Leopolis, and I'm the founder of the Thea Foundation in North Little Rock. And this video is to educate those who want to participate in our 2021 uh, performing arts competition. So let's get started. I'm going to share my screen here and we will get going. Again, I want to welcome you today and it won't take very long, but I would like to cover everything about our scholarship competition uh, in the performing arts. So first of all, we established the Thea Foundation and um, really on November the 5th, 2001. And we started the foundation in the honor of our late daughter, Thea K. Leopolis whose life was transformed by the arts. And we wanted to pass that forward to all of you uh, so that you could get enthused about your talents in the arts by uh, participating in our scholarship competition. You'll see at the bottom there that our mission is to advocate the importance of the arts in the development of our youth. And we know that your participation in the performing arts art form is really good for you. It motivates you and it gets you in touch with yourself and what you like and don't like. It probably helps you in school. It helps you with relationships, makes you feel good about yourself. So that's why we do this. These are some pictures of our late daughter, Thea. She was a wonderful young lady. This was uh, her uh, one of her pieces of art that she did. She actually was in drama, so she did performing arts, but she also did visual arts. And this was a finger painting that Thea did, uh, one of her very first projects that year in visual arts. So here are our winners really from two years ago. Uh, we award 36 scholarships, and these were our winners when we were able to get together and do our awards ceremony. But last year due to the coronavirus, we couldn't. But I wanted to show you that they look just like you. We have uh, every socioeconomic group represented and we have um, every race and color and creed. We're very proud to have such a representation. Uh, here are some photos of some of our performing arts winners over the years. Uh, you'll see a dancer there on the left and on the right. You'll see uh, some uh, people doing drama uh, in there and you'll see a singer. So we support singing, dancing and acting in the performing arts. Um, should you be interested in more than one art form, you may participate in, two, in more than one of our scholarship competitions although you're only allowed to win one. This is fashion design, slam poetry. We also have scholarships in creative writing and in film. So you'll see over here how many scholarships we award in each of our competitions. We award 10 in visual arts, 10 in performing arts, four in film, uh, five in creative writing, five in spoken word or slam poetry, and two in fashion design. A real important aspect of our competition is over here on the right, and that is our, the inclusivity of our competitions. We don't care about test scores, grade points, and we don't care if you major uh, in the art form, you win your scholarship in. If you do, that's great. But if you want to go on a major in anything else, go for it and our scholarship will be there for you. You'll see in the middle there, 
that our scholarships first place, first place wins 4,000, second place wins 3,500, third place wins 3,000, fourth place wins 2,500, and fifth through 10th places uh, all win $2,000. On the right, you will see our education partner list. And uh, these are schools across the state uh, that award additional scholarship money should you win a Thea scholarship. So be sure and take uh, advantage of that if you're going to stay in state to go to school. There are a few out of state schools there at the bottom as well. So uh, who is, uh, who can uh, sign up for our competitions? Um, oh, first of all, we have awarded 436 scholarships for $2.4 million. We're very proud of that. Who's eligible? any high school senior in Arkansas. This is only for Arkansas students. Really, if you're getting your GED uh, that next year, uh, you're eligible and or uh, if you're homeschooled, uh, you're certainly elig eligible to sign up and compete. So we're gonna talk right now about how to sign up. So I'm gonna get out of this slide presentation and I'm gonna to connect to the internet and we will go quickly to our website so that you can see uh, how to get there and uh, So we're going to go to our landing page for scholarships and, and you get there by going to the Thea website, which is theafoundation.org. You go to what we do and then just below what we do says Thea scholarships. And it will take you right here to this page and over here, on the right, you'll see visual performing, creative writing. So all the scholarship pages are here. Now, while you're on this landing page, you can see that the deadlines are here for all the competitions. These are the deadlines for, for signing up and for uploading your uh, audition video. You'll see down here, performing arts uh, is January the 15th, that's the deadline to sign up and upload your video. But to go to that page, you come over here and you hit Performing Arts, and then it takes you to the Performing Arts Scholarship Competition page. And please read all of this, there's really not that much. Um, but right here, it shows the awards for the different places. Well, we just talked about that. It shows you that it's an online competition only, and you can register, uh, you need to register by the 15th. This talks about the auditions. Uh, it tells you that the audition video can be up to two minutes long, um, and that we accept singing, dancing, and acting. Uh, we do not do instrumental solos. If you play a guitar and sing, then we will judge you by your song and you may certainly accompany yourself. If you have somebody that'll play the piano for you to sing, that's fine, or you can play a track. So however you accompany yourself singing, that's fine. Uh, you are not allowed to sing a cappella you must have an accompaniment of some sort. Uh, the actors, uh, again, we allow no uh, costumes of any kind, just your practice clothes. And if you're singing, dancing, or acting, you may use one prop, which is a chair. There are no other props that are uh, allowed. 
So um, those are those rules. And uh, the video requirements, I'm not gonna go through all that. You can read that here, but you shoot your video. Uh, we do not want a professionally produced video. We just want either your uh, mobile phone or if you have a camera, that's fine, but we do not want special lighting and all of that. Just shoot the video with you doing it, putting it on a, put it on a tripod so it's good and stable, and then uh, uh, you're good. We're not gonna judge the quality of the video. And then it shows you there when you upload it, how you name that file. Uh, then to register, you simply go to the registration button down here. And when you click on it, it takes you to a Google form and you fill in this form. You have to answer all the questions. And then after you do your Google form and submit it, you can come back. And if you're ready to upload your video right then, you can click that link and you it takes you to a Dropbox dialog box and it'll ask you for your name uh, and then it'll ask you to choose the file you want to upload. So uh, it's that simple. You do not have, you can go ahead and register now if you want to uh, and you can upload your video just as long as it's uploaded before noon on January the 15th. So that's the video today for uh, this uh, performing arts competition uh, students. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to email me at scholarships at theafoundation.org. Scholarships at theafoundation.org. And uh, again, you can enter more than one competition. Hope you have a good day. Thank you very much. You might pass this link to onto your friends so you can, uh, so they can see it too.